FU Top Gun 2018. I'm Chad Ricardo. Joining me right now, my main man, Mr. Logan Tanner. Logan, when I think of what it means to be a true FBU student athlete. I mean, you really epitomize that. How many camps have you been to at this point? This was actually my 16th camp. Your 16th camp, and how many Top Guns even? Uh, this is my fourth Top Gun. That, that is absolutely remarkable, bro. I want you to uh, kind of take me back to the beginning. When, when was your first FBU camp? My first FBU camp was actually my fifth grade year. Mm -hmm. my, that summer, I was actually a linebacker. So, really? Yeah. Okay. Um, my coach is Howard Tippett, and uh, I mean, I got exposed so many times <laughs> I can't. I got my ankles broken left and right. So. Wait, so, so you, Logan Tanner, you were at camp and you got exposed? Look, the, the people that are watching out there at home, I, I'm certain that they don't believe that because they look at who you are and the things you've accomplished now. So It was just off, off my footwork and my, uh, my speed. So I just went home, got a trainer, mm. started working on my footwork and my speed. And actually my trainer, he actually told me I needed to go to tight end, so... I went to tight end, came back, and just dominated. Even from that early age, you understood then how important it was to work on your craft. You weren't going to leave that in just talent alone. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That's, uh, that's what FU's taught me, mm -hmm. just work on my craft. So as we fast forward a year, so now you're at the tight end position. What do you feel as though is the best attributes within your game as a tight end? Uh, I feel it's my size, my speed, my strength, and also just my footwork and agility. In my soft hands. Whether we're talking about the Gronks, the Jimmy Grahams, all of the tight ends that have revolutionized the game, who do you most feel as though your game compares to, college or professional? Um, I feel it compares best to Travis Kills, the tight end for mm -hmm. the Kansas City Chiefs. Yeah. He's my favorite player, and I feel like I can just relate so much to him. He's probably one of the best slot tight ends. You can just go out there and just score some of your touchdowns like that. And as we look at your game and the way that you hope to continue to evolve it and translate it, like I said, you are here at FBU camp all the time. Where do you look to, to improve? How do you get better from where you are to the point in which, it, you know, we're not, we're not gonna take you to Kelsey's level yet, but how do you continue along the path to one day being one of those big time tight ends? Well, one thing I really need to work on right now is just my route running. That's not my strongest attribute. I just need to work on that and just FBU has taught me a lot and just keep on working. Technique beats talent when talent fails to work hard. So. Oftentimes we see student athletes like you and we believe, man, this kid was just born this good. But you have the work ethic to back it up. Why is working that hard? Why is it so important to you? Uh, I mean, one day I just want to make it to the NFL, you know? And just, I don't want to see my family struggle anymore. Every time I get on that field, I just think about, you know, my, my mom and my dad, just how they had to struggle to get me here. And, I just don't want to see that anymore. So they sacrificed so much for me, so I, I feel like I should sacrifice for them. You've been at FBU camp getting better. You've been a part of the FBU National Championship Series, competing out there as well, and like we said, multiple Top Gun camps. To anybody that's watching at home, do you uh, recommend the FBU experience to them, and if so, why? I think FBU is probably the best camp out there. And you're going to learn a lot of stuff. You go on the field, you learn from NFL coaches, you go in the classroom. You learn from your film, you get to evaluate what you've done, if you've done well or good. I feel like FBU is probably the best camp out there.